I think a lot of our fears and challenges are grounded in the people who use and access the internet. Because as I mentioned before, the, when you talk about broadband, when you talk about the internet, when you talk about computers, when you talk about cell phones, those things are neutral. It is what and how you use them that will make the difference, positively or negatively. And so uh, what I see for the most part, uh, for those who use this in a constructive and meaningful and, and legally binding way, that the sky is the limit as to you know, what's next and what the future holds. For those who um, have other ulterior negative motives, this just allows them, with all due respect, and this should be scary to all of us, this allows them to be more efficient. But what we have to do as a, a collective, as government officials like I am, uh, those of us who are uh, in this space and who care about this space, what we need to do is collectively check and balance those who do not mean uh, uh, this, our environment, our state, and our nation, and our world, uh, do they, they do not mean us uh, well. Uh, you know, we need to work collectively and use the same technologies to put them in their place. And so that's why I, I, you know, I always say that this, these disruptive enabling platforms allow us to be better us. Now, that might not conjugate well in your classroom, but um, what I will say is it allows us to be better at it, um, and we just have to decide what it is we are better at.